a couple of like personal things that I know all of you gals will definitely appreciate. Maybe not you guys that follow me, but definitely you gals. And then you guys can get some information off of this as well too, because you will actually realize what it takes to really better yourself. And so I want to start there. One, there's a couple things you might not have seen that I've done, that I've done, or maybe I haven't like um, announced it on another video entirely, but I actually have hair extensions now. And I want you guys to be aware of this because I want you to know how powerful you are in your limitations. And there, the reason why I got hair extensions is because for two and a half years, I absolutely hated my hair. Absolutely hated it. Like you can look at my old videos and you can see it was short. It was like very uh, puffy. It was just not manageable. Um, the lady that cut off my hair uh, like two and a half years ago, she cut it literally all off. And it was just her neglect on listening to what I wanted. I wanted to keep it long. I wanted to actually have it like an A-frame, this, this shorter and then come down longer. And she totally destroyed my hair. So she not only did that, she ended up over uh, bleaching it. So it ended up damaging my hair for two years. So when you have the wrong person working on your hair, it could totally destroy your hair forever. And so basically I had to let it grow out almost three years until I had all fresh new hair. So it, by the time I got extensions, it was finally like at my um, shoulder blades, just underneath my shoulder blades again. So it made me feel like myself again. And that is so powerful when you feel like yourself, you feel whole, right? And so I actually was neglecting that wholeness in me. And I want you to know that it's important to discover those things about you, your insecurities or the things that you can physically do, you know, with the hair extensions or maybe like a nose job or a facelift or a boob job if you're a woman, you know, um, liposuction. Um, you know, getting into that fitness routine, changing your diet, whatever it takes to feel you again. And that's all that matters. It doesn't matter if other people don't believe in it. If they say, hey, it's a fad diet. Hey, you don't need to lose weight. Hey, you know, I, you look good with, uh, with short hair. Hey, you know, you don't need to wear makeup because, you know, you're beautiful the way you are. Uh, whatever it is that people tell you about you and you're like, that's awesome, that's amazing, you know, and feel validated. If you still don't feel like you, you should still honor yourself enough to go and take that extra step.